Welcome back to Site Tech and Mountain Earthworks training videos. In this video, I wanted to do a quick tech talk on thumb drives, what seems to work and what doesn't work, and maybe some problems that you may be having with the uh, thumb drives and different machines. And I'm talking all the way from the uh, old GCS stuff up to the new Earthworks stuff. The old GCS equipment seems to take thumb drives pretty good, but it doesn't like big gig thumb drives. What I mean is if you have a 32 gig or 156, 256, those don't recognize sometimes or work. The old GCS kind of likes anywhere from an 8 gig to up to 16. Uh, Earthworks, the newer stuff, seems to be able to take bigger thumb drives. We've been noticing if they're not formatted or formatted properly that there's been some issues and I just wanted to talk a little bit about that. So right now I've got a handful of thumb drives that I carry around with me that we kind of had our logo put on it. This is a 16 gig thumb drive. Um, got the blue in there for the 3.0. What I wanted to show you is I'm actually in a relatively new 14 grader massless that has the TD540. Now this thumb drive, you can format them with your computer. If you take your computer and do a full format, it doesn't matter if it's the quick format or the one that takes or does a longer format process with it. But even after you've done a formatting with your computer or laptop or your data collector, whatever it is from the Windows side, there's been times that we've noticed that the actual Android needs to do it. So let me show you, for example, with this one right here. I go ahead, I've went ahead and put my project library on there, have quite a few different designs on there, but I haven't actually formatted it with the actual TD yet. And this is what we've noticed, is it's formatted on my computer, but if I go ahead and put it in, it still recognizes that a USB drive's been put in because I get the normal input process. But if I go to the next screen right here, notice on the top left, there's no option for the thumb drive or there's not even the little menu option that normally comes up. So I'm pretty well stuck. I can't do anything with it. Here's what you need to do though, is you need to try to format any USB drives that you have if you have a handful of them or if you just have one that you carry around like me and you need to format it first because obviously when you format it, you're gonna lose everything on there. But there's really nothing you can do here. So if you back out of this screen, on the TD540 and go into the gear right here and go down to storage. So the storage option right here. Now you can see that it actually recognizes the USB. It has the name, but it says unsupported right here. So grab your USBs that you need, come in here, put them in, go here and go to the setup option right here. And you'll see here where it says the vendor C USB drive needs to be formatted. And this is actually something that the, the Android side is doing, not the Trimble side, to make this usable, and it's not the formatting on the computer. So go ahead and just format that USB drive. It's gonna remove everything on it, just like any formatting would. And now it's good to go. So I'll show you. I haven't dumped the, uh, the designs back on yet, but I'm gonna show you if I go back into cat grade before I actually dump it back on to the USB drive. That if I go into my job setup, go file transfer, I still have the option to do that, but instantly now I have that little menu right here at the very top. So I can hit menu and now I've got the USB drive. I'm gonna throw my project library back onto my USB drive and show you that it'll work every time at this point. Okay, I just loaded my project library back onto the same USB drive. So we're gonna go ahead and put it in now that the Android has done its job to it. Same process here, hit next, and now you can see I've got the menu at the top right here. So I can go ahead and hit the menu, pick my USB drive, pick use this folder and allow, and everything's good to go. Now I can see all my projects and I can bring everything in. So just be aware of brand new thumb drives before you load them up, send them out to the job site, that there's a chance you need to format them. You can do it on your computer or you can do it here on the tablet. And this is what we would suggest right now is just let the Android side do it and then you don't run into any problems. So thanks for watching this video from Site Tech and Mountain Earthworks training videos on USB drives and formatting.